first stop on our tour of my favorite places is St. Mark's Square in Italy. At St. Mark's Square, visitors can visit St. Mark's Basilica and Doge's Palace. The culture is spectacular, even with all of the pigeons flying everywhere. This is what St. Mark's Square looks like during the day, current times. And this is what it looks like at night. The history goes back to 1935. And as you can see, not much has really changed. Our next stop is the Magic Kingdom Park in Orlando, Florida. At the Magic Kingdom, guests can be immersed in a world of fantasy. There are rides and attractions for all ages in four different lands. Fantasyland, Tomorrowland, Frontierland, and Adventureland. This is what the park looks like today. This is what it looks like at night. This is what it looks like in 1995. As you can see, the buildings around it weren't all that made yet. Our next stop is Cadillac Ranch in Texas. At the Cadillac Ranch, visitors will see a replica of Stonehenge, but made of cars, aka Carhenge. Here there are cars dug halfway into the ground for visitors to spray paint and, paint and leave their mark on. Stop here for a very unique roadside attraction. This is what it looks like during the night. See all the stars? This is what it looked like back in 1938. As you can see, the cars were still dug into the ground at that point. Our next stop is the Grand Canyon in Arizona. At the Grand Canyon, visitors can view history from over 2 billion years ago. The Grand Canyon is one of the biggest canyons in the world, measuring up to 270 miles long. Now we are in the canyon. This is what it looks like at night with all the stars. It's such a beautiful view. And this is what it looked like back in 1937. It looks pretty much the same since it's been here for over 2 billion years. Our next stop is Sequoia National Park in California.
At Sequoia National Park, visitors can drive or hike up a large mountain to see the largest redwoods of the country. These trees have been kept around for thousands of years and are being preserved to keep their history. This is just a look of the terrain that surround the park, not necessarily the trees. But here's the sunset with all the stars. There's the sun. And this is what it looked like in 1931. Again, pretty much the same because nature doesn't really change. Our next stop, and our final stop, is the Dole Plantation in Hawaii. At the Dole Plantation on the Big Island, visitors can learn how pineapples are grown and distributed throughout the world. They also have one of the largest garden mazes to honor the pineapple. This is as close as we can get to street view. This is what it looks like at night. You can't really see because there's no sun. This is what it looked like in 1984. I don't think it existed then. Well, that's it. That's all of my favorite places in the world. Thank you for joining me.